this is my week. Okay, so this is the beginning of my second day here at the hospital, and so far, um, I mean, during the night last night, I was able to actually get a good night's sleep. I um, slept like like from 11 till 5 without having to get up, and um, so I consider that um, very very good, very nice. My my gut's feeling a little bit better, um, and you know, with what they're what they're giving me. Uh, with the drugs and stuff, so um, all that's fine. I just hope soon um, I'll be able to get onto some soft food to see how that starts digesting, and we'll see how it all goes. And they're giving me some potassium because I'm low on potassium. Uh, oh, obviously, I haven't eaten anything in the last how many I'm three days now. So yeah, hopefully they get me on something more solid soon, and uh, we'll see how the day goes. But I think I'm gonna be here on my own today. As you see, it's like. Really here. Yeah. See, it is really snowy outside. So I don't think I'll have too many visitors today. Um, had a few visitors yesterday. I had, like I said, Pastor Manisha, my mom, my brother came by, so that was good. But my wife, he's out working today, probably all day, and she probably won't be back till late tonight. So it's just gonna be me on my own. Saturday. I'm free. I'm kidding. Uh, I just got up and I'm about to have some soft food this morning. And, uh, we... They're on to me. Um, but anyway, yeah, I'm going to have some soft food, see how it goes down, and see how well it digests, and then we'll keep on going from there. Hello. Hello. Hola. Why do I have all this stuff strapped to me? Um, because apparently something was wrong with my heart, or, or they think... My heart was down a little bit last night, so they were attaching this heart monitor to me, but now it's back to, to normal. It's probably because I hadn't eaten food since, like, in like four or five days, so. But I just had breakfast, and then my heart rate went up, so. They'll probably take this off in a few hours, but I just wanted to videotape it to see all the, I got all the wires and stuff that's just, like, all around here, and I got a little pouchy thingy. Want to see that pouchy thingy? Hmm? See? The pouchy thingy, too. Because they're, like, keeping an eye on me through, like, the monitor outside. So I use I have to have the pouchy thing to carry on just in case I have to go to the bathroom so it's not like hanging down or anything. Mm -hmm. yeah. Fun stuff. Got in Wednesday night, so Thursday, Friday. So it's my third day here and um I am now on a soft diet and it's kinda of funny. I, I had a light breakfast. Um I just had some eggs and um, some carrot juice and just some of the things to see how it go down and then I'm doing a little bit more for lunch but um, so I, you know I'm restricted soft, soft diet so there's so many, so many things I can eat um, on, on the menu that they have at the hospital and the funny thing is though I'm thinking okay I'm seeing all the entrees and I'm looking at all the entrees on the uh, on the menu I'm just like okay I probably won't be able to have much anything so um, and they didn't really give me a definite list so um, I called I call the, the gal up to order uh, the food, and I said, you know, they didn't really give me a list, so I was asking her, I mean, um, and I know I'm on a soft diet, um, you know, what, what on the entrees can I have? And she's like, hmm, well, let's see here, you're on a soft diet, so you can have this, and you can, and she's naming like a, a dozen things, and I'm just like, oh my goodness, okay, so I could eat a lot more than I thought I could, but I ended up just getting like some something, you know, a little light, I'm like, oh, well, that, that's actually great, but um, let me just go with this to start out. So, but anything I wanted to eat, actually, I could eat already. So it's kind of funny. Even on a soft diet, that's what I would have been eating anyway. Um, so kind of funny. But uh, I'm still hooked up to IV. Hopefully, probably might get that off tonight or maybe tomorrow morning. But I think I'm still going to be here for a few days because they're 
concerned about me and they want to make sure that I come out okay, which is fine. I don't mind. Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday morning and we're looking at the greenhouse at the hospital. And I'm standing here and last night was pretty darn good. Um, I mean, I'm still attached. I mean, but I'm not attached to that anymore. And, um, I um, must just say that um, food is going through me well, and the medication is going well, so I think um, by tomorrow I should be able to be discharged, uh, pending anything else um, not happening, going wrong. So, I mean, they're still monitoring me. I'm still on a soft food diet, so I'm not on a regular diet yet, so I'm sure they're, they'll up that up and see how I do with that. But, um, so far, so good, so... I am happy and just relaxing and resting. Okay, so um, I just got another um, infusion of steroids, and I've had that taken these past few days. But this time, um, my brain is kind of uh, all slow, and, and my speech is slurred. And, I don't, I don't know if the reaction or whatever will figure out. Hopefully it's my mind will clear up. It's just my mind just all muddy. It's like a, it feels like a bunch of mud is in my mind now. I'm trying to clear it out and just try and splash head, head in my head with water. And, and this ain't, <laughs> this is going to look terrible. Yeah, so it's the end of what's going on so far being at the hospital. This is the end of this week. And I will see all of you next week, hopefully with my head attached to my body. Bye.